I just went to the birdiest spot in America. In this video, you get to tag along as we see endangered birds, rare birds, and everything in between. The first stop of the day was to see a rare bird called a cattle tyrant. This is the first time this bird has ever been seen in the United States before. It only took us about five minutes to get great pictures of this very rare bird. So I am here at Packery Channel Park, and the main target here is American Oyster Catcher. There's been some great-tailed grackles and yellow-rumped warblers flying around. Um, we could get the American Oyster Catcher later today, but Packery Channel Park has historically been a great place to get them, so we're just going to do a quick stop here and see what we can find. So we just got the oyster catcher. They're pretty unmistakable. I'll pop some video up on the screen right now of it. Um, a lot of laughing gulls and royal terns flying around right now. So I got a forester's turn. Not a whole lot of shorebirds. The only other one is a willet. There's one right in front of me right now. There's also some savannah sparrows up here in the grass and a couple great egrets out on the flats. So I just got an osprey flying overhead. I had heard several ospreys calling today, but that was the first one that I've seen. So I think we're going to pack it up here at Packery Channel and head to Mustang Island State Park where there should be a pair of Aplomato falcons nesting. So hopefully we can see those because that's an endangered species and be really cool to see. So we found the Palomato Falcon. He was not on the nesting platform over there. He was actually perched on a post right behind me. Um, it's an endangered bird, so really cool to see. It's pretty far out there perched on a post, so I wasn't able to get very good pictures, but we were able to get some pretty good looks at it. So I am here at Port Aransas Nature Preserve, and the main target here is going to be whooping cranes. There's been a family of three that have been hanging out here for the past couple of years. I was able to see them last year, so hopefully we can see them again this year. So did not get the whooping cranes here. However, I did see a gall build tern, American white pelican, and red-tailed hawk, which is pretty neat. So I'm here at the Liana Bell Turnbull Birding Center, and there should be a lot of waterfowl and stuff here, so let's go take a look. So I'm up on the observation deck and there's a lot of birds here. We got American White Pelicans, Northern Harrier circling overhead, um, some Long-Billed Dewitchers, two species of teals, um, Blue Winged and Green Winged. Also got American Coots and Common Gallinal. I think we got like 27 species here, which I believe that puts us around 60 species or so for the day. So we ran out of time to stop at this place, but there was a bar-tailed godwit reported here. It was last reported earlier this morning, so hopefully we can go find it. Unfortunately, the bar-tailed godwit was too far out to confirm its ID. However, it seems quite likely that this bird is in fact the godwit, as it was reported to have been associating with five marbled godwits, and it was seen just three hours earlier.